and a thousand Meals on Wheels Association of America affiliates in the U.S. Tonight, News Channel 5's Tanya Rogers shows us what the local affiliates affiliate is doing to make a difference for seniors and the homebound. <laughs> Volunteers for Meals on Wheels of the Palm Beaches pack up the meals they will be delivering. Charitable donations and grants help the program reach out to those in need. We are trying to get the word out to a lot of insurance companies because as people maybe are recovering from um, hospital stays, they might need us for a short term. We do grant writing. We have companies that step up to the plate and do adopt a route. Companies can call us. They can either donate financially to underwrite somebody that's in need of food, or they can go ahead and have some of their employees do that community outreach on behalf of the company. Good Samaritan Medical Center is helping in the the preparation of the food. The hospital's executive chef makes sure the meals are nutritious. We've gone to a lot of homemade items. We see our own pork chops, we make our own mashed potatoes, um, we cut our own fresh zucchini, they have fresh vegetables, and we make our own desserts. Once the volunteers pack up the meals, then they start to deliver them to area residents who are part of the Meals on Wheels program. We were incorporated less than a year ago. And we have started our first meal in January with just a handful of people, most of the people that actually helped start this. And now we're approaching 40 volunteers and we're approaching, uh, uh, we're over 125 meals a week right now. We have hopes to go to seven days a week. Uh, right now we're delivering five. We have hopes to move into um, special needs and special dietary concerns. Right now we give you a healthy meal that comes from a chef in a kitchen at a hospital. Reaching out to the community. Tanya Rogers, WPTV News.